about Mr. Mr. Wright making a comeback? Um, well, we finished filming for the Queen's episode last night, and he was there uh, for a big birthday for Arj. Um, I think yeah, it's cool. I think everyone. It's not for uh, for some reason at the moment. There's not that much drama going on, so it's sort of like. I don't know, they brought Mark back and it's just everyone's having a laugh, yeah, it'll be good. So, but, was he welcome back? Yeah, he's welcome back. I've, I've got no problem with Mark, we get on well, so. Any chance of him staying around for a bit? I don't know, I really don't know. Um, apparently, we've been told it's just it's just for the Christmas Actually, episode. Yeah. Whether or not it does, uh, it's up to Mark, I suppose, and up to ITV. So. Can you uh, give us any gossip from last night? Um, well, you have to tune in and watch it on Wednesday, but it's, there's a lot, of, a lot of fun things went on. A lot, obviously, there was a bit of drama. Arj's birthday is so what you expect. Um, it, it'll be good. It'll be good. Make sure you watch it. It's on Wednesday. And a headache this morning, was there? Um, a little bit. Not too bad. I, I was quite good last night. I was driving, so, but I stayed up late. So. Okay. No. So this year, have you been naughty and all nice? Um, a bit of both, probably. I got a girlfriend, haven't I? So that'll be good now. I know. You've got all boring now. Well, I feel I thought it was time. I've um, I've been single for a long time now since I started the show, and I uh, met Chloe a little while ago. and We've been getting on well, so I thought. So it's going well. Yeah, it's good. Yeah. Any ring or anything yet? No, oh, n nowhere near. Yet. But, I mean, we've only been seeing each other probably. Well, we've been talking about about six months, but going out for about three, four weeks. Check out Truthloader. We're the home of citizen journalism online. We've got playlists on Syria and the recent Israel and Palestine conflict, and there's also a playlist of weirder stuff. We've also got a great new show called Truthloader Investigates, which looks at the kinds of things you won't see on the mainstream news. And if that wasn't enough, we'll also be hosting live debates, which you can be a part of. Check out whatever you like, but the best way not to miss out is to subscribe.